It's a clean lift from the shore, but it turns out flying over water was a good idea. Okay, here's some things that I, am, I think are very odd about the, the video, which kind of suggests to me that it's a hoax. Okay, so it starts out in 1080p. Uh, it's pretty clear, as you can see. Now we go to his takeoff. I'll just pause it here. Um, we don't see him take off, we just see him flying. So the takeoff's been missed. Now, this is, this is like 240p or something. If you look at the white lines, you can see you can see just how uh, pixelated it actually is. It's not sharp at all. He's wobbling around on the board. Um, it looks to me like it's it's hanging from his feet. It's not supporting his weight. Okay, here we go to a wider shot. This is this is also very low resolution, um, which you can see by looking at it. Okay, that's not 1080p. That's not that's not even 360 probably. Okay, and I think it's I think this this could be to, to hide maybe the cable or just to hide something. Okay, so this shot here it's reasonably sharp. Um, I'm not sure if it was prepared beforehand or or what. It's quite sharp though. So we're back up to like say 1080p or something like that, 720 maybe. Okay, and then coming to the landing part, this is dropped down again to some pretty low resolution. Lack of quality of this footage compared to what we saw before. So he comes straight down, so he's being loaded on a cable, and boom, he's landed. Right now, we flick to the the high definition camera on the side of the pitch. So. I'm just wondering why we didn't see him land. It's, it, it could almost be like he's already there and have just flicked to this. Okay, why doesn't he use the, the good close-up camera to film his landing? And why do we not see him land from this shot? I just wanna, just wanna watch this bit one more time. Okay, back to low res, and down he goes. And it almost looks a little bit computer generated to me. Okay, he lands, and then we flick to another shot. Have you ever been watching um, television of a football game and it's just suddenly dropped down from high quality 1080p footage to 240p really sketchy footage? I've, I've personally never seen that during a, a live broadcast. Okay, so there's that video, which um, all the other videos you see online are from that one or they're from this one. So there's only two videos. Um, two source videos for this uh, event. This is the second one, let's have a look at it. Okay, so the takeoff was missed, that wasn't caught in this video. And he's out of frame already. But it is, it is a decent quality. If you look at the people, it's, they're looking at something, but I'm not sure if they're all looking uh, in the right, in the same direction. It's hard to tell, but it looks like maybe they're not, and some people just aren't paying any attention to it at all. Okay, so we've got some professional photographers here. Down next to the pitch. Um, doesn't appear that any of them are taking photographs of this. Uh, they seem to be more interested in the players, um, or their own cameras. Okay, so the the photographer just put a finger in front of the lens there at a pretty critical time. That could be to add realism, or it could could be um, added in later to hide something, perhaps. Okay, so he's coming straight down, as so if being lowered, and then then he lands like that. Cool. And it'd be good to try and match this up to the other video, but it's difficult because he moves away. Okay, so in a way that video is uh, more convincing um, than the first one. 
uh, for me anyway, but it's still a little bit suspicious because we they miss the takeoff. Um, the landing is pretty hard to see as well. And just the general level of camera work, it's the kind of thing that we'd see on a fake UFO video where they make it like so bad to give you an idea that it's kind of genuinely somebody filming who doesn't know what they're doing. Okay, the last thing I want to look at is just the, the size of um, this drone that he's standing on. Okay, to my mind it looks pretty small. Okay, it's got like eight rotors um, and they don't look particularly big. And I think it's it's a little bit of an illusion, like it's kind of hidden how small this thing is. If we take if we take it and, and make it look like it's hanging from it at the same size, it kind of shows you just how small this is. And I think if if someone released a video of somebody hanging from a drone this size, then they'd immediately see that it's probably a hoax. But with them standing on it, it's kind of it's hidden somehow. I'm also a bit suspicious about the battery power. He doesn't appear to have a particularly big battery on board and batteries are a problem with uh, electric flight in general um, as far as I know and particularly with drones. I'd imagine a lot of power would be needed for this um, so a battery would be quite heavy which would add weight to the whole system. So it doesn't appear like he has any big batteries on board so I'm wondering how he's getting all the power. If we compare this to other um, drones that are probably legit, then it kind of doesn't quite match because this is a lot smaller and it seems to be carrying a lot more weight. Okay, so in conclusion, I believe this is uh, probably a hoax um, for the following reasons. Okay, I've never seen. Um, HD TV dropped down to 240p in the middle of a broadcast and this is what happens here and it happens at some critical times such as when it's flying and um, when it's got a wide view uh, and the part when it's landing. Okay, I also believe it's suspicious how they they haven't filmed him coming down to land uh, with the pitch side camera it just cuts to him already landed. Um, <clears throat> The lack of videos of this, it seems that there's only these two videos online, but every other video is a reproduction of these videos. Also, um, I believe that the drone looks too small, the props look too small, and this is comparing to the other uh, drones doing the rounds at the moment, which uh, seem to be legit. They all seem to have issues with batteries, weight, and they are a lot larger than this. Okay, let me know down in the comments section um, uh, if you think it's real, why do you think it's real? Um, if you think it's fake, why do you think it's fake? I'd be interested in your opinions.